Hey guys, what's going on? It's Khan, Mr. So Real, and welcome to this week's video covering the state of the game for the division. Well, it seems it's going to be a pretty short version of uh, state of the game this week. There aren't too many things going on, but uh, we're going to cover it and let's try and get through this as quickly as possible. Um, so let's get started. Let's go. That's me. Yeah, there hey. you go. Hey, hey, Mitch, how's it going? Welcome to State of the Game. Okay, guys, welcome to this week's State of the Game. Um, this is, as I said in the intro, going to be a pretty short one, but there are some things that uh, are worth talking about. Number one, there, since 1.6.1, there have been some bugs that have slipped through the cracks and have made it into the game. Uh, some of which I've experienced firsthand and I'm sure quite a few of you have experienced uh, but they are going to talk about which ones they know about and that they are going to fix uh, they also give some uh, they also ask for a kind of favor towards the end uh, but just as a heads up if you are looking for 1.7 information it is not coming in this state of the game so don't expect too much out of that um, if you guys do want me to talk about what's going on with 1.7 uh, and what we know so far, then I can probably do something uh, about that a little bit later. But I was just planning on doing the state of the game and I'm just watching it now. And uh, yeah, I'm kind of disappointed about that too. Uh, I did hear some of the things that were said from some of the ETF members and I kind of have an idea about it. But uh, again, I'd really like to play it first. Uh, I talked about this on my live stream on Twitch. Uh, but if you guys want me to talk about what little bit of information we have, leave a comment in the comment section and let me know. I'll give you a little roundup and give you a couple of my thoughts if I do so. Uh, but without further ado, why don't we get into this uh, and get through this video so you guys can see what's going on with the division right now. And we can talk about that at the end. We won't be talking about 1.7 today. There will be many times in the future that we will be talking about that. The ETF being finished last week. Uh, we obviously didn't do a state of the game last week, like we had said. But the ETF being finished does not mean that we can talk about 1.7 just yet. But we will have uh, a lot of cool things to talk about there very, very soon. Lots of shiny stuff to show you in the coming weeks. 1.6.1 came out last week, and there are issues that we know about. Uh, intense, although it doesn't happen very often, will sometimes set you on fire. We yeah. have a fix for that, which we're testing at the moment, but we will uh, let you know how that one's going. As of last week, uh, there was a fix deployed for exotic caches that weren't dropping in legendary mode. Actually, it was the next one. Boom. It's nice. almost like I saw that. Rapid quote. isn't working properly. Uh, the haste portion of it is working, the 15% uh, haste, I, and I, I use it, and I really like it. I have my max skill haste build, which is fun, but it also reduces the effectiveness of your healing. Not intended needs fix. Grenades still have issues. Yeah. What I'm issues, about Gabe? The stagger issues? Yeah. Yes. So yeah. That, that's still happening after the patch. Yes. Defibrillator is not working correctly. The defibrillator mod for first aid, the skill, um, it's not working all the time. Uh, MP5 blueprint for, for PS4. I mean, that's one of those old things that uh, RNG Jesus has not praised us with a, a PS4 MP5 blueprint. I'm sorry. Um, that would be cool, uh, but the way it works right now, we don't have um, the ability to put that on for you guys. That's all for today. Got a joke, Gabe? My life. Whoa! Uh. I want to talk about what you guys think the biggest issues are with the game right now. I've seen a lot of uh, very interesting threads about, um, you know, we have people who love Dead Eye, some people that don't, some people that love Seekers, some people that don't, some people that uh, think we have a lot of build diversity now, some people that don't. These are really interesting conversations. I'm not saying anyone is right or wrong. I think there are interesting points on both sides, but please continue to uh, speak up about what you think. I seriously mean it. That's what we need, uh, and your involvement very, very much helps. All right, so that is all for the state of the game this week. It was a very short one, and real talk, I n never really watched Gabe's streams, but that dude is kind of funny. Um, <laughs> I gotta, I gotta give props to Gabe that that joke at the end. It, it had me, <laughs> it had me cracking up. Um, but yeah, Hamish made a good point about 
getting your ideas out. Uh, he briefly talked about some of the things that a lot of people are uh, talking about with Deadeye and with uh, the Seeker Mind Rolly Balls. Um, as a quick thing, I'm going to put out my two cents about those two because I know a lot of people hate them. Um, Deadeye in particular, I would say uh, a lot of people say that it's OP and it sucks. I would say Deadeye is not that bad. The only problem I have with Deadeye is that there's really no counter and none of the other uh, heavier hitting sniper rifles like the slower ones like the uh, the M44s, the M700 uh, carbons or whatever. Like none of the heavier hitting sniper rifles really work and it seems like the Deadeye is almost catered for the SVD. And again, there's no real counter for it in a lot of cases. Now, a lot of the lack of counter comes from lag, which really is something that I've hoped they would fix by now. But uh, if you've watched any of my streams or seen any of the videos I've posted lately, you know that lag has run rampant and the game seems to be performing much worse. Um, so I'm not really sure if making Deadeye weaker is going to really fix a lot of the problems uh, with it because sniping in general isn't as rewarding as uh, gunplay where you can kind of move up freely. I think having strong snipers is key to keeping people out. And, you know, as a someone who snipes, um, I think having bolt actions and some of the faster firing snipers do absolutely nothing, which they did before some of the buffs to uh, Deadeye, it did kind of turn a lot of people off to sniping and not really want to do it now when it comes to seeker mines uh, again it's a lot of the same thing it seems like lag is is a huge issue and there's no real counter for it you you often don't see it coming it blows up instantly and there's really nothing you can do about it the only real counter you could have to it is uh, exotic damage resilience and if you do choose that over some of the other options it's not always you know going to pay off so there is a trade-off for it personally i'd like to see the uh, seeker minds do something where they beep more or make some kind of noise or at least have some point where they're active or that you can uh shoot at them a little bit more before they explode or something but especially in last stand the reason why a lot of people die is because they never see it coming and that's really a big problem. Um, so if they could do something about that, I think a lot of people would be in a much happier place. I'd like to see the other sniper rifles come up, especially the bolt actions. And um, yeah, that's that's pretty much it. Or even uh, what they could do is have something where uh, the damage comes over time with a, a bleed effect similar to Predator with Deadeye. Uh, that can be countered if, if it's an issue of having a counter there needs to be something that would give players enough time to do something about it and uh, give them a chance to either get into cover or move forward or go a different route uh, I think that's I think that's fair uh, as someone who does like sniping I, I do think that that's fair uh, leave a comment in the comment section let me know what you guys think about Deadeye and about the seeker seeker mind rolly balls uh, I'm all ears and you know I'm listening to you guys so Leave a comment and let me know what you think. All right. So on that note, let's get out of here. Uh, I am Khan, Mr. So Real. Be sure to check me out on Twitter, Twitch, Instagram, uh, of course, on YouTube and uh, also on the uh, Facebook pages as well. So I'll catch you guys later. Good or garbage. The vendor reset will be tomorrow. So why don't you guys enjoy that? And uh, let me know what you guys think about that as well and what you're going to pick up. So I'm gone. Peace. Peace.